technology that we are adopting to delivering this service. Now, everybody or anybody could actually put up an application that could manage, um, that could do exactly the same thing as Primero, but not everybody will put into cognizance the, 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 the best practices, the governance, the security, the, the seriousness, you know? Because these are sensitive data from kids and people all over the world. You wouldn't want it to be in wrong places. At the same time, these are trying, we are trying to reach out to children, even in the deepest remote areas where you do not have um, network connectivities, no internet services, and these people are gonna go into the field and you have to reach out to these kids. So you have to make sure that your solution is well capable enough using modern technology that could cover for those use cases and edge cases. So I, I saw those technologies and we are actually adopting those technologies and this is really, really an awesome thing for UNICEF. It's going to be, every time we roll out a product like this one, uh, we ensure best value for money, fast time to market. Um, we make sure that the, the product is sustainable for the long term and that um, all other aspects, uh, which are critical for, for programmatic tools, such as like, you know, data protection, et cetera, are also taken into account. And the transformation here is like the more digital tools uh, we have that follow this business model and this, this new way of offering the, the, the programmatic digital tool to um, to our frontline worker is just going to get more services, more quality services to our beneficiaries. A more available tool, um, easier to use, um, really easy to deploy in a, in, a, in a small amount of time, we'll just have that. Get more beneficiaries in the system, deliver more uh, services to, uh, to them. So that's, that I think is, uh, is, I mean, could be transformative for uh, from UNICEF. It was one of the meetings we had at, uh, at uh, Microsoft offices. Uh, it was a meeting room uh, filled with uh, 20 plus people. Uh, brainstorming on, on some some technical uh, issues that we've been trying to to resolve uh, in in uh, in uh, uh, new version of, of of Primera, and seeing twenty plus people coming to to slowly piece by piece to 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 common goal and and shaping the the, the form of of uh, uh, new Primera was really really a great experience. I'm, I'm really hoping that uh, by that time um, we'll, we'll do two things. One is um, to, to uh, make onboarding and running all of those initiatives when it comes to the technical part uh, way easier uh, and, and uh, way quicker. Uh, on the other hand, we would, we were hoping that at our partners in, within UNICEF uh, will recognize the, the value of what Primero uh, along with us is, is doing now and try to, to follow the same path uh, from the day one of, 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 uh, of their projects. So, so at the time uh, when, when uh, we need to, to, uh, to run those applications or whatnot, uh, they will be fully in line with with uh, our cloud offering, and and the entire process goes way way smoother than than it used to in the in the past. 